Hello guys! Today I want to show you my top 3 prints I almost use every day. So on place number 3 there is this little piece. You might wonder what does this thing do. This thing attaches to the IKEA Stukvik. I hope I pronounced it right. It is in our bathroom and this ho does hold our razor. I will show you a little picture about this piece in action and it does make things pretty easy. You just slide in your razor and it is always safe and in one position and doesn't fly around in the IKEA Stukvik. Pretty useful. As always, the files of the creators are in the description below. Place number two. Place number two is this glass stand. It is an easy to print glass stand which contains three glasses in total and we got two of them in use. One for my glasses and one for the glasses of my wife. We use those every day because I need some glasses to drive with the car and in the summer of course our sunglasses are on those stands. Place number one. Base number one is something I cannot show you as a printed part right here because it is mounted in our Hemnes shoe cupboard. In this Hemnes shoe cupboard, after about one and a half years, one of the brackets which holds one drawer broke and the bracket became loose. So as you can see in one of my videos, I will link it around here. I redesigned the part and printed it out in white PET G material. And as of now, I have to look at the watch. It's almost half a year. This thing is in use and it didn't break. If it would break, I would reprint it simply and mount it again because it's working quite well. And you have to keep in mind this cardboard is every day in use and this part is holding. The original part was a injected molded part, but the patchy is still withstanding the daily use. 3D printing isn't only for vases or for Pikachu's low poly models or something. They look nice, but there is also a useful effect of 3D printing. And if you've got a 3D printer, it is useful to Print some stuff you can use every day and make your life much easier. I hope you found this uh, information useful for you. If you want to reprint one of those projects, just go into the description. There, there are links for the glasses stand and for the razor holder. If you need the file of the Hemnes part, you can contact me or just write it in the descriptions below. I will read them, of course, and maybe I will upload them to Thingiverse if there is a high demand on this part. I further have small news because I have my first backer on Patreon. You can see me all smiling and super happy. NPG 3D, which is now on my wall of awesomeness right here, it is a pretty small wall for now, but the first one did support me. Thank you so much for this. I really appreciate this and this means a lot to me. With my first Becca, I feel like I'm doing something right. I never thought that somebody wants to support me on Patreon. And I really appreciate it that somebody wants to support me, support my work here on the channel. It feels very good and I, I'm so, so thankful. Uh, thank you very much. I, I'm really happy. So NPG3D, you are here on my wall. You are the first one. This inspired me to update my Patreon uh, tiers. There are now three tiers. Go check them out. As always, the link is at the end of the video. And this is everything from me today. Thank you guys for watching and as always, I wish you a nice day and goodbye.